I'm gonna bop it a boop it a bop it a beep it a bop it a boop. What was it doing? Need to speak to Marshall. Pope wants us to compile all of Darling's data entries in the past month. She wants us to crack them. Had to take a detour into the quarry, but I found plenty. Here. We will start HRA production immediately. I promised I'd tell you about Dylan once you helped us. This is Aramir. it. She knows. Seventeen years I've waited. Your brother is here. He was once known as Prime Candidate Six, codename P6. We brought him here <laughs> after the ordinary event. He was groomed to be the future director. He had talents far beyond any other candidate in the program. Of course he did. We found you together. We share a bond. Are you with him now? So you kidnapped him. We took him in. Your parents vanished along with every other adult in Ordinary. Eventually, his power changed him. There were casualties. He wasn't fit to be the director. Did you know about this? Is this why you didn't bring me here sooner? Were you keeping me away? Where is Dylan? He's kept in the containment sector, in the Panopticon. My brother. I thought we were the same. What if we are? I'm going. Now. I expected as much. I need to go check on something. Something I cannot let the Hiss find. It shouldn't take long, but you must watch the Bureau while I'm gone. And remember, Dylan is dangerous. Do not let him out, Director Faden. How do I make her stop calling me that? I'm not here for them. Nothing simple here. These people took my brother, but they've accepted me without question. Are they my enemies, or my friends? I need to see Dylan. I need to know. I wish you could tell me what you know, explain things. Just stay with me, okay? I could use a friend right now. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. Let's see what I spend these on. I got more health, more energy. Let's see here. Can make that yet. Uh, these are... I'm gonna run around here first. It's ridiculous. Pope's grasping at straws. Why? I don't if remember this if is there's any uh, things around here. Jesse, when you were down in research, did you run into a Dr. Rhea Underhill? I didn't. Who is she? She was, is, a colleague of mine. A researcher studying a kind of extra-dimensional mold growing below research. Well, I don't like the sound of that. No one does. Look, I haven't heard from Rhea since the Hiss arrived. Would you mind having a look around for her next time you're in research? Of course. Thanks, Jesse. Now, what's on your mind? Hmm. I visited the quarry. What's the plan for all that Black Rock? The Bureau has used Black Rock almost exclusively for containment purposes. See, I say, branch out. Instead of boxes, helmets. Instead of blast shields, knives. Knives? Yes, knives. So many combat applications. Slicing, stabbing, gouging, or... 
Couching. Sorry. I've been trying to get Darling to explore combat applications for years. I've got a little excited. Wow. I did not expect that from her. Yeah, there's a lot of excitement about gouging people. This place is looking good. Arish is making real progress around here. Right? This place is a fortress. And with him taking care of operations here, I can spend more time analyzing the Hiss. I've been attempting to isolate and neutralize the Hiss resonance in blood samples, but no luck so far. So you can't reverse it? Not yet. But perhaps reversing it is too simple. See, if his resonance can rewrite human genetics, then perhaps it's a question of rewriting the his resonance. In theory, that could pave the way for custom human genetic alteration. I wonder how often the phrase mad scientist is used <laughs> around here. True. How is HRA production coming along? better than expected. We've already made enough to get people out of a couple safe rooms. They're here, alive, thanks to you. We never would have lasted this long if you hadn't walked in those doors. You deserve thanks too, of course. We got this place up and running together, Emily. Oh, it is. Something about Emily's face, going. just like... Enjoy your data. Feels off. Oh, I will. Pope wants us to compile all of Darling's data. She wants us to crack Darling's personal logs? Who crucifies it? Who does she think she is? Here, I think I've been in here yet. Nope, oh, definitely haven't. Let's see here. The America Overnight Program. The America Overnight Program has operated successfully for years. Originally designed to assist in providing disinformation to the naturally skeptical population of America, it has additionally led to the discovery of numerous AWEs and altered materials by allowing civilians to call in and report their experiences with the paranatural. In fact, America Overnight alerted the Bureau of and in its first year of operation alone. In this report, the investigation sector had cataloged and categorized each episode of America Overnight, which has resulted in a successful bureau investigation in order to help AWE occurrence analysis. The more results of the night springs, the more have been cataloged in separate report. Further file for full report. Mm. Ew. Hmm. Yeah, I already know that. <laughs> I already figured that out. See if there's any doors I could couldn't open before.
There we go. Just got that done. I never went in here and read this. Federal control. Due to recent fluctuations in the Earth control point, the area stability has been downgraded to yellow. Reference chart green is stable. Yellow low possibility of unanticipated building shifts. Orange high likelihood of anticipated building shifts. Red frequent unanticipated building shifts. in this area I couldn't go to before. Why did it have to be a f one of the flying seated ones? Why does it also take forever to reload? I'm literally standing at the place it's got to reload me to. Come on. There you go. Jesus Christ. Watch this, right? Just look at it. Yeah, yeah, watch that. Eight inches wide and capable of storing a lot of Oh. I gotta put it there. Oh my fucking god. Is there another one in here that I didn't see before? Ah, uh, yeah, there they are. Oh my. I can't see shit because it reds all but it's red all my screen. Oh, I love enemies spawning behind me who shoot rockets. Fuck and god damn it. Like, god damn it. Fuck off with these assholes. A floating fucker who throws heavy shit at me. Rocket motherfuckers who are just hiding, waiting for a chance to fire a rocket at my butt. Fuck off. I just want to explore this area because I haven't fully explored it. B 
Spirit Book Bunch has will converse in the usual spot in the corner table of cafeteria at 5 p.m. on Tuesday. Currently discussing uh, use, unless you by D.D. Brooks. Everyone should get their reviews by Monday before lunch. Can I generate some conversation starters for the meeting? God, this is a terrifying program. Look at the puppet! Fucking Jesus! Hey, Meg! What's wrong? My mom's dead! I'm so sorry, Meg! What happened? I don't know! It was loud! It's like the dirt! That's unnerving. Well then. I don't think that should be shown to children. shoot them too. Okay. Right, assholes. There's no protection. Oh, not a protection one. That's annoying. Who may concern? I am being contacted by the past presidents of the United States of America. They appear spirit guides giving me wisdom. John Adams keeps saying I need to fix America, but I can't really understand him. They have, all lot, they have a lot of opinions. People telling me I'm imagining, but Theodore Roosevelt showed me the, how to fix my lawnmower, and I don't know a thing about lawnmowers. Explain that. I have a great dead man telling me all about the past and present. <laughs> If I'd like, if you'd like to use my abilities to help run the government, please let me know. I know the White House could use me. You're <laughs> <laughs> the fuck? Weirdos. All of them are weirdos. Headshot damage. An extra 15 and just in general is nice. Yeah. 
Right. Question mark. Oh. I never open this. Maybe it's good I'm exploring. Never know what I'll find that I missed. There, double check on the back end there, and then no. Head out the mail area. I'm not sure how I'm supposed to deal with that crap. Yeah, nothing in here. Okay. Right, Didn't really do that. Meant to do this. Let's head to research. Where was it I was supposed to go? Parapsychology? Loading times take forever. Forever! There we go. Like, how am I supposed to pass that when I'm supposed to protect them from a bunch of fuckers who explode and they just run at the people? They're sh <laughs> like, you guys have guns. Avoid them. Don't run at them. Avoid them. <laughs> how am I supposed to keep you alive when you just keep running at the things that are blowing up and killing you? I don't like those missions because they're just always a bunch of exploding guys. Who just with uh, with dumbasses who don't avoid them? It could be one thing if it was like if we were fighting ones who just shot stuff, who just fire shings, because it's like at least they're smart enough to duck below cover to potentially not get shot. But there's only so much I can do. Uh, 
But it's the ones that can literally, you know, just go at them and explode. I can't save them from being stupid. <laughs> I can't save them from being stupid. Low Central Research. It shouldn't take that long. Learning research. Oh yeah, I should go and check and see if Artie need, needs anything from me. I'll do that after I do this mission. That's weird. They're gonna stand on opposite sides from each other, but perpendicular to each other. Weird. Oh my god, stop running away, you fucking asshole. Okay, what the fuck am I getting caught on? A little lip that I should just be stepping up onto, like a step, but nope. Central research. I'm assuming I have to go down. But where do I go down? Did I find this before? Maybe I did. I did. I did. I came there before. Even more. That's it. 
And this is the... Yeah, this is the one when the dead poets. This one's the... Uh, left for the fall. Hey, the boy, I can't get down there. It must be this then. But I can't go down there. That's death. Like, that is definitely death. Unless. I do this. Very carefully go down. Carefully bring myself down. And whoop. Voila. Well, this is gross. I don't like the weird animal noises I'm hearing. Are good. Careful in there, ma'am. Little areas under quarantine. I wouldn't go in there without talking to Underhill first. Even if you have. I still wouldn't go in. And I'm going in anyways. Excuse me? Are you lost? Excuse me? I'm your boss. Shut the fuck up. I can go where I want. <laughs> Hello, Rhea. How's it going down there? Enjoying the mold so far? Setting back into the life of the old FBC? I wanted to ask you how the coffee with Emily went. She's a star on the rise, incredibly bright, extremely intuitive, but I want to hear from you about what you thought about her. I think you two would be very good on a project together. Could learn a lot from each other. Let's get together and chat about it soon. Anyway, sorry for the interruption. I I'm sure you can think of any besides the mold right now. You always were a woman of focus. I admire that about you. Talk to you later, Casper. Do you normally barge into people's private workspaces? She clearly doesn't know who she's talking to. I'm your boss, bitch. Shouldn't you be in a safe room? Why? Because of those his things the rangers keep going on about. Haven't you people sorted that out yet? The situation down here could spell doom for the Bureau. You mean this mold? Correct. Perhaps you could help me. I require samples of various mold strains, and the mold has made the environment far too dangerous for me to fetch them myself. Really? Mold samples? I thought this could spell doom. It could, and it will, whoever you are. The mold is spreading. We need to find the source before it spreads too far. Any samples will do that? No. Samples of five unique strains, when blended properly, will allow you to travel deeper into the pit where I've pinpointed the approximate location of the source of the mold. Okay. So what do these samples look like? Similar to the one on my table there. I've made a list of the samples I need. Here. You'll find them throughout the threshold. I'll take a look. My name's Jesse, by the way. I'm sure it is. Ah, rude as fuck. Have you worked at the FBC very long? Not long enough to understand their inane methodology. They want me to solve the mold, but how is one to solve anything when the basic molecular structure of this fungus is an utter enigma? Oh, sorry, are you asking me? It's rhetorical. The Bureau wants to control, not comprehend. But to answer your question, I'm a seasoned threshold researcher that's been brought in on a provisional basis to resolve this matter. That's all you had to say. 
What have you learned about the mold? Firstly, the term mold is a gross oversimplification used only to ease communication. That said, the mold itself appears to be the product of complex microorganisms. They spin the mold, building structures like minuscule cities, swiftly colonizing our dimension. And the speed of these tiny engineers relative to their size, simply staggering. So it grows fast. If you're not going to listen, then why did you ask? So the mold is coming in from... where? We don't have a name for the threshold dimension. The origin point has been identified, but the density of the fungus makes it impossible to enter. Even if we could, I speculate that we would only find a reality entirely subsumed by the fungus. Total decomposition! It's weird how excited she is, right? A little bit weird, yeah. What do you know about the Hiss? How could I know anything about an entity I have only just learned of? This is exactly the Bureau's problem. My work is always interrupted by these, these superfluous matters. Superfluous. Just keep your HRA on and I'm sure you'll be fine. This crude thing. I thought it was Darling's idea of a practical joke. Not quite. Just keep your head down while I handle the hiss. Rude as fuck. I need to get going. Try not to transport any spores outside the infected areas. Just for you, I'm gonna transport them everywhere. I'll start with the perspective. Three, three, Thresholds Utility Research. Dr. Darling's recently penned essay titled contains some glaring omissions that I feel must, I must shine light on. Firstly, the entire premise of the essay in that quarry threshold is beneficial to the Bureau, while the mold is effectively, actively hostile to use his words. He cannot determine the worth of these dimensions and their life forms being bureaucratic definitions. Secondly, the mold is much more beneficial than some rock. If she creating the mold of if the creating the mold would yeah, were <laughs> la, 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 were reconfigured to their purposes, the structures they could have built would rival with the greatest skyscrapers. The mold's resistance to various strange diseases were attempted to introduce that would be derived into Yes, admittedly, the application is more difficult than picking up a rock and gluing it to, to a wall, but I pause the but I pause to wonder when the bureau would lost its eagerness for a challenge. Refer to file 2-35-1863 for a full report. Back to it then. <sighs> smells so sweet down here. Something I'm really hungry. I wonder how this mold tastes. Not sure what I was shooting, but I did find My god, it's a mold monster! Let's see here. What do I have? I reorganize this. Is it an op? I wish there was an option to like reorganize stuff. I can go three now? I didn't even realize I could do that. Haha. <laughs> Definitely should though. More energy. I'm 
Those are running out of space for these. Question, I have no idea. Ah, what the fuck? sake. Jesus Christ, this, this place is dangerous. Oh, well. Oh my god, this place sucks. sucks balls over here no better health that's nice Ending machine Really no idea where I'm supposed to go. I'm assuming this is one of the things I need. One of Underhill samples.
the fuck? Building shifts occur at random and without warning, but with the Bureau's cutting edge technology, we can stabilize the oldest house. Safe employees are happy employees. Right. Certain rituals allow agents to navigate the oldest house as well. But accidents do happen. <laughs> Trapping agents inside the walls. I heard you got stuck in your room for three days, Topher. Too bad you didn't have your book with you. Or any food. And remember, kids, when you feel the floor deviate, it's already much too late. <coughs> How the fuck is this meant for a child? Like, this was supposed to have been made for a child. What fucking child was subjugated to that? Like, I grew up some weird shit as a kid, but even I didn't grow up with like, that, that level of like, ah, oh, yeah, you're gonna fucking die, kid. <laughs> Checking up. Okay. Oh my fucking god. Where did you come from? Where the fuck did you come from? I came back down here just to make sure I didn't miss anything. You fucking like blow up in my face. Rude. One. Alright, that's just three more to go. Upgrade to spin, upgrade to pierce. Okay. What's like this? Where was it? This. 
uh, in the power plant specifically. Not upper power plant, specifically power plant. Oh, I gotta figure out where the nodes are. Should be like red glowing light to indicate. Ah, uh, I have to go up. Can I go up? How do I go up? I didn't think about that fact. Oh, let me do this. Yeah, there it is. Fantastic. Okay, good. There's stairs at least. Just can't shoot through here. That'd be too easy. that fucking ball. so I can just
in with this bullshit. There we go. Need to go up there. Oh, my God, this is obnoxious. All right, I'll get these here to the bottom. One on this level. Uh, poorly designed. What's over here? Anything? Yes. Seize accelerator. Oh my fucking god, where did he even come from? Like, I was alone and he just appeared. Why are you 
doing that? Oh my god, why do you just keep spawning? I have other things to do. Why are you spawning up there? I can't shoot through gritting is annoying because this would be a lot easier if I could. There's still enemies. I have no idea where, but there still are. threshold. We wait again for it to load, for it always takes forever. I don't want this. Increase in seizing enemies Just makes that a more viable option. Not as much I'm like being shot at. They made me think to look over there. This must be one of the samples. That leaves two. Where are, where are the corpses? Where are corpses? I need to find corpses. Back down. Find anything I might have been missing down here. And I found that one there. You never know. Like that one was literally underneath a staircase. They literally could be potentially anywhere. Uh, 
out over here? It's a toilet. Aha. I found it in the shitter. Ugh, gross. Underhill is gonna owe me for this. Still leaves one more, and I feel like it's probably in that main area. I kind of. Oh, that is so much faster. Let's finish him off. from there. Oh, hey, what the fuck? Nothing there. Oh, yeah, it's literally right here. Dirt. This looks like a good one. That's all five samples. I should get these back to Underhill. Bone M1 coming through. You look like a woman with mold for me. It's a weird thing to say to someone. Active thresholds slash mold research. So you want to know how my mold research is getting on, Casper? Here it is. Microscopic organisms similar to appearance to construct the art the architecture of the mold. I do not understand these the original disseminators of the mold, or are they bitten to make some fungal infection? The mold is the most prolific and durable organism I've ever seen. I theorize there is mold source located somewhere on the, on our side of the threshold, rooted here and accelerate growth in our dimension. I refer to this yet unknown source as mold-1. The mold procedures are enticing aroma of encourage human consumption of itself. It propagates in the chest cavity and quickly subsumes the entire body, seizing control of the motor functions. This behavior is now is not observed when I first arrive, which means the mold has adapted to our presence, targeting our biological imperatives in a way that we spread. It's truly ingenious, little thing. Full report will soon be ready. Keep your sacks on. Keep your sacks on! Ooh. Still, though, the health recovery is nice. I found L5, but I kind of wanted to eat them. The mold has that effect on some people, likely due to the fact it's not actually mold or even of this dimension. I suspect it is the result of two incompatible molecular structures, one dominant, coming into contact. I call it mold or fungus because it's closer in appearance and behavior than anything else we know. 
except perhaps bacteria. She reminds me of my old biology teacher. Did you happen to meet any more members of my ranger detail? I didn't see any rangers, just walking mold people. Unless... Yes, if you found mold people, you found my rangers. I refer to the creatures as hosts. They, like other unwary agents, succumbed to the appetite. But that's nothing for you to worry about. The pill I'm about to make with these samples will make the lower level perfectly safe to traverse. It has the added benefit of immunizing you against the pit's toxic spores. Hey. Now leave me to it. It is that thing that lets me go into those rooms. I need to get going. Try not to transport any spores outside the infected areas. <laughs> 